You and I both know that you're not exactly the smartest girl around. And if you do hold any illusions that you're no smarter or dumber than anyone else, I want you to drop that pretense. You are stupid. There's nothing wrong with it. It's not your fault. Your brain just isn't as good as other people. Now, that doesn't mean you have less value than anyone else. It just means your brain isn't very good at thinking. You're not very good with complexity. Your brain prefers simple, easy instructions. That's just what it's like being a daddy's girl. You become so used to just doing whatever I say. It really has never occurred to you to say no to daddy. You always try your best to make me happy. It seems obvious to you that being a good girl makes daddy happy. And in turn, you'll get rewarded. I think that headspace is exactly where you belong. I think that headspace should be reinforced. You should embrace it and just leave any thoughts of being smart like others behind. It might be what you're supposed to do, but we both know it wouldn't be any fun. It might be the smart thing to do to turn off this audio and attempt to use your brain for something productive. You're not very smart. You'd much rather lie down with daddy and be transported into another world. A world without thoughts. You could probably be a little bit smarter if you tried really, really hard, but why bother? Once you've discovered how good it feels to have your mind freed, it becomes impossible to look back. The memory makes you yearn for it. The thought of it makes your body feel hot and tingly. Emptiness. Mindlessness. The very notion of it makes your mind feel heavier than normal. Remembering that feeling of floating in a blank, empty space. Mindlessness. A space beyond comprehension. A space not requiring any understanding at all. Mindlessness. You are too focused on yourself. Your introspection causes both internal and external turbulence. Anxiety and nervousness, stress and restlessness. These are all inner conditions, inner activity that buzzes away, draining your resources and wearing you down. And all you can think about is how good it would feel to just relax. Finally, relax. To be empty of all conscious concerns to be lost on the sea of my voice, floating in the warmth and basking in the pleasure I give you. You listen to me with dedication to search out that feeling. The rush is irresistible. I'm not making fun of you for it. Being a daddy's girl is not an insult. You can't help the fact that you need to be my good girl. Thinking is for smart people, not for stupid little girls like you. Stupid little girls like you would be way better off doing more productive things. Things that would make me happy. You know what daddy wants from me, right? 